I got another quick one for you. I've got two 100 foot cords. They both look very similar, but one of them has an awesome secret. Now what we're going to do is Noah's going to take one tail and I'm going to take the other and we're going to race to the pickup. And whoever gets to the pickup first with a nice straight garden hose wins. The loser has to pay for Dairy Queen. So we're going to set it up and we're going to test it and then I'm going to show you why one cord is better than the other. One uh, garden hose is better than the other. Really? We're going to get Dairy Queen? Yep, we're going to get Dairy Queen. Loser pays. Oh. Loser pays for Dairy Queen. Nice straight cord. No kinks or not. Ready? Yep. Set? Go! <laughs> Alright. Yep. That sort of showed what I was wanting to show. Good Dairy job. Yeah. Now, as you can see, Mine turned into a jumbled mess. No, I keep pulling on yours. Yeah, I'll Noah's able to keep on rolling. No knots whatsoever. All right, Noah, now pull on mine. Keep on, pull, pull, pull. See, and then you get a jumbled mess, which normally um, it's worse. But of course, because I'm trying to show you something, it's going to actually perform it's just like a kid. But come here, kid. All right. But I'll show you. The way I, I did know is his will never tangle. And you can do this with extension cords or uh, anything like it. Here, hold it, kid. So traditionally, if you're like, you know, what I've always done is you throw out your loop and then you just keep making nice tight loops around and around and around and uh, until the hose is all done and that's all fine and dandy if you don't transport it by the time you pick it up and transport it and put it down these layers have flipped over top of each other and kind of then as you're pulling off you've got knots or cables going in between layers and it makes a knot so what we're going to do different is just one small change so we're going to make our normal loop and it it's went over top and then our second loop we're going to come down and it actually is going to be inverted so it's going let me start it on the ground all right one loop normal the second loop there we go comes in from the bottom and then the next loop goes up around and in this loop we're going to flip it inside the other loop does that make sense can you see that on the camera there little buddy yep okay so then, well, we make it dress it up a little bigger. Okay, then the next one comes around on top. And then when we get down here, we curl it under. Oh, I'm hanging hung up on your foot. And then we come up through and we lay that one there. And then we come back around on the top. Oh, like so. And then once we get down here, we flip it under. We flip it under and we feed it back up through and back around to the top and then we get back down here to the bottom and we do one more one more where we flip it under and that is good to go so watch this as I pull this off you focus on the pile it just comes off nice and smooth there's no kink there's no uh, tangles So hopefully that helped you guys and um, you can use this on extension cords, on garden hoses or anything else that normally gets tangled. It's one of them things where you go to use it and you need it quickly and it'll turn into a knot. But if you needed it to save your life, there ain't no way in the world it's going to turn into a knot. But if you fold your stuff up this way, you can always guarantee that it'll come unraveled the way when you want it to. So you guys have a great day. Don't forget that Noah can't run the camera today. 
streaming of Nerf guns in Halo. Um,